So welcome everybody. Uh, this is our, one of our two Harveys. So he really helps us put into a clinical context all the stuff that you're learning both in physiology and in clinical medicine. What I'm going to demonstrate for you is a normal heart sound. Okay? So come and show me where I would hear the aortic area first. Where would the aortic area be? Can you remember? Very good. Excellent. Now, the first thing you might notice about that can you hear the second heart sound? Now let's think. So would you like to come, um, um, Amish, and palpate for the moment. Hold on, how do you find the carotid? You feel the middle line, and then you take your fingers over to the first sulcus there. That's it, good. Well, just up a wee bit maybe, just perhaps a little bit there. There you go. And as he's breathing in, now, which part of the heart is the most mobile, which is working the hardest? Very good. So that's the bit you're going to be able to feel. That is going to be where the left ventricle is working hardest. So now let's re review the areas of auscultation again, because this will come again handy. We've got, which area was this one? Aortic. Aortic. Not quite. Tricuspid, which is a third and fourth left sternal edge. Now, how are you going to decide if that is a systolic or a diastolic murmur? Amrish, how are you going to decide that? Um, one of the, uh, how are you going to decide? According to the card. Excellent. Off you go. So, ladies, you can, you can palpate too. Perhaps, uh, Julia, you can palpate and tell us, perhaps just for well, just, do just one side at a time. You can hear it up in the carotid. It's radiating up into the carotid. Okay? 